Hey there everybody, Sean Halley here for Guitar Tricks. Uh, I wanted to give you guys a sneak peek at a free new app from Ultimate Guitar, the fine folks who run the popular tab website. Uh, it's called Tonebridge, and it represents a really fast way to get to the heart of the guitar tones from some of your favorite songs without needing to know anything at all about guitar gear. All you need is a device that lets you plug a guitar into your iPad, so you can pick up an iRig, uh, an Apogee Jam, or the one we're using today, the Sonicport VX from Line 6, and you're ready to go. So basically, once you launch the app on your iPad, you'll see that it is a lovely UI. They spent a long time making this look gorgeous. So you've got tons of graphics here. It's got suggestions for you about songs and tones and sounds and things like that. And some of these are already put into collections for you. So you can see things like the Loud and the Furious and Post 90s and collections like this of some songs and tones that they really like. So for instance, I could go to Clean and Smooth and look in here if I wanted to start with something cleaner. Purple Rain and <clears throat> Wicked Game. Um, Nile Rodgers played on the tune Get Lucky from Daft Punk, so maybe I'll start there. And now you're seeing basically a guitar pedal uh, with this great graphic on it. So uh, one of the great things about this app is that some of the most iconic album art from all time is stretched across these pedals. And the pedal itself represents basically the entire guitar rig that was used in the studio to make this noise. And you control it with just two sliders that control the knobs as well. One is for the effect and one is for volume. And in general practice, especially on anything with distortion on it, you can think about effect like a gain knob, the amount of gain that the guitar is getting uh, into whatever the signal chain is. So, uh, you know, in general, when I want more distortion, I want more gain, I will turn up the effect knob. Now you can see here on the right hand side, there's a play demo button. If I want to get an idea of what the part was that they actually use, I can actually hit the play demo button like this and it'll play the track. So you get the idea. Uh, you can tell that it's not just a clean guitar sound. There's also a phaser in there, so it's got all the effects built in, everything you need. So if I turn the effect up to like 80%, something like that, kind of high, and now I've got that same sound. So it makes it really easy to play funky stuff because I already have this great funk sound built in. If you want to explore something a bit more lead guitar, uh, we'll pop out to the main menu. There we go. And uh, in the top of the week, I've noticed that there's the Hotel California sound in there, which is really cool. So you can see that great iconic album cover strewn across the top of that pedal. Now, if I hit the eye icon in the top right hand corner, it gives me a lot of information about that tone. You can tell that the part of the song this tone actually relates to is the solo, the role that this tone is playing is lead guitar, and the suggested pickup is bridge. So it means that as long as I choose the bridge pickup, I'll be the closest to the way the sound is on the record. So if I turn the effect up to like 80%, something like that, I go to my bridge pickup, theoretically I uh, can play a part of the most iconic guitar solo probably of all time. So I don't have to worry about the song. I don't have to worry about any of the gear. As long as I just search for the song that I know, I can go right to it. So what if I actually don't know how to play that solo yet? That's very possible, because I obviously don't. Um, if I hit the open tab button here on the bottom, on the bottom right, you can see it says, the ultimate guitar tab HD app is required. So uh, if you want to, you can get the app and it will let you see the tablature for all the songs in here. So I've got a pre-production version, but there's already a thousand songs in here. So you can tell it's gonna be a great platform for being able to practice or play along. I'm not gonna do this right now, I'm just gonna say later. But if I wanted to, I could actually do that. Now, let's say that what I'm looking for is actually not in here. I don't see it right off the bat. I'm not seeing it in the top list or in any of the collections. Well, you can actually search for it. So if I do a search, and I just say, you know what? I really want to make myself feel terrible about how little I've been playing guitar. I'm going to select Eruption. <laughs> so if I select Eruption, there you go. There's Van Halen. I'm going to turn the effect all the way up. And uh, now my guitar is going through that classic Marshall rig that Eddie had for the record. And it has that phaser. <laughs> Great. 
It's awesome. It's like high school. Awesome. In any case, if you're more knowledgeable about gear and you want to tweak, this may not be for you. Uh, but the folks at Ultimate Guitar have definitely created a really lovely app that takes the guesswork out of getting the tones from your favorite recordings and basically being able to practice along with them and learn them uh, if you don't know them already, which is great. Thanks a bunch for watching. And if you're not watching this on Guitar Tricks, check us out on the web and via our own apps on the App Store. Guitar Tricks is the foremost authority on learning guitar on the web with a step-by-step -step beginner learning system and video lessons teaching nearly every possible popular song you can think of. So I'm Sean Halley, and I will see you again next time. Thanks and cheers. Hmm.